Metaverse. Metaverse, metaverse, metaverse. The more I say it, the more I like it. Metaverse, metaverse, metaverse. Anyway, so um, just wanted to go over a few things and give you guys, so I'll tell you what happened last week, tell you what's happening next week, uh, and then give you some new rules that, uh, that the uh, almighty metaverse is putting out there that you need to know, you need to pay attention to, um, so uh, you don't get in trouble and don't end up in meta jail. I wonder if meta jail is bigger or better than Facebook jail. Hmm. All right, so uh, last week, had a great week last week, uh, ended up doing a, um, uh, a really cool event down in right at the edge of League City and Friendswood at Matt Hyde's branch. So Matt Hyde, Mario Garza, um, Abe Gallagher, Ray Kimbrell, uh, they all put on this event that we did at Matt Hyde's branch. And uh, it was pretty freaking awesome. Uh, had a great group of people, great group of realtors. Um, and, and it was, it just, it turned out really well. It went over really well. Great group of people. Matt has an, uh, an amazing facility, amazing building. And, um, you know, everybody was so responsive and so helpful. It was really cool. And then immediately I had to um, leave there, uh, get on the road, um, run up to Arlington, which is about 250 miles away. And then uh, one of my good friends, or actually a couple of my good friends, uh, that own a group called Insurance Soup. And if you're in the insurance business at all, I highly recommend seeking this group out. It's called Insurance Soup. It's about 43,000 um, insurance salespeople in that group. And they had their first event. These guys, it was it was funny because um, 10 weeks ago, they just decided, hey, we're going to have an event. And um, they ended, on, ended up putting this thing together in 10 weeks, which they said they'll never do it again. Uh, the next one's going to be, I think, six months from now, and they are starting on Tuesday of this week, I believe is what I was told uh, to put it together. But they had it at uh, a place called Texas Live, which I've never been to, didn't even know it existed. And it is right in the midst of like the baseball field where the Rangers play. It's uh, right next to... Uh, Jerry World. Matter of fact, it's like right across from Jerry World where the Cowboys play. And just what a really amazing venue. Um, uh, just a great, great setup. Uh, I was amazed at the audio, the video, everything that they had. All of the background was just amazing. They did a great job. But uh, Michael McCormick and Taylor Doby did an amazing. I mean, they put this thing on. I know it wasn't just them. I know it wasn't just them. I know that they had tons of help. I just don't know everybody's name that helped them. But uh, we went up there, did that, uh, sat on a panel, and was part of that. And I was very honored to be part of that. It was a really, really cool thing to be uh, invited to that and to be part of that. So I, I was really, really happy about that. Um, then let's see, next week we've got some stuff going on, uh, going up to Norman, Oklahoma and um, uh, doing one for John Kennedy and Chad Brandt in Norman, Oklahoma. Looking forward to that one. That one's going to be cool. It's going to be, I think it's the first time I have done this in Oklahoma to tell you the truth. So I'm looking forward to that. We're putting together the presentation now. On the presentation that we do, it, it truly isn't ready and finished until about 24 hours before the event, just because things change so much and we wanna make sure that we've got the newest and latest and greatest information in there so people know it. So speaking of that, here's some things that you need to know about Facebook rules and things that are changing like right now as we speak. Uh, the very first one is the uh, crazy people who uh, own and run this system are tired of uh, climate doubters and uh, they are taking an extra special hard look at people that are, I think they call them climate deniers is what they're calling them. So uh, uh, make sure that you pay attention to what it is that you're putting out there. 
Uh, my thoughts are it's going to be one of those things that if you do it too much, they're just going to suppress you. Uh, you may end up going to uh, meta jail, but they are they are adamant about they are removing this from any of those uh, meta systems. Uh, another couple things is you're we're losing some features, and it's. Um, you know, I, I always thought the features were kind of strange anyway, but they kind of made sense. Like, uh, if you guys remember, if you had location services turned on inside of your uh, your meta system and you uh, were ever in a, um, a location, let's say you were at a, a movie theater or a shopping mall or whatever, uh, where other meta users were at that were your friends, it would give you notifications and let you know that some of your friends are right there at the same location or same event venue or whatever it may be. Those are going away. Some people have lost them already. Uh, some people will be losing them here shortly, um, it, 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 but it's going away along with another few things. Uh, the weather uh, notifications are going away. Um, I kind of liked that one somewhat, uh, but it's just, it's being looked at as just being too much in your business kind of thing, uh, you know, in your Kool-Aid, so to speak, if they if they do all of these things. The other thing I think is kind of funny is uh, a few years back, there was a uh, class action lawsuit in Illinois uh, about uh, Meta, about Facebook at the time, and um, what rights they had to data and what rights they didn't have and what they could use and couldn't use. So believe it or not, some people in Illinois, and I think the number's pretty big. I think it's uh, like one and a half million people are going to start receiving a, uh, a check today, a little less than $400 uh, today from that lawsuit coming out. So that was kind of a big deal. And uh, one thing that we know is once one state has done it in one and and its citizens have been uh, rewarded, other states will probably pick up. I don't know if, I assume that there's other ones going on, but I think other states will end up picking it up and, and doing it also. Try and stay up if you would. Uh, still, no matter what, this is the number one most used piece of social media in our country. And, and to tell you the truth, in the world, uh, the only place that it's that it's a dramatic difference is in um, uh, the northern side of Europe. Um, Instagram is bigger there, but so I want to give you these these guidelines, the things that are coming out, the things that are happening. So you one don't waste any money, don't waste any time, but you kind of always know what's going on um, for you and your business. I still think this is one of the the best ways to get business and there's a there's a ton of people out there that will agree with me so pay attention to it uh, other than that that's really uh, most of everything that I have for you this week uh, hopefully if any of you guys want to uh, uh, go to Norman Oklahoma just look for the sign up or reach out um, as far as uh, the SEO stuff keep up your SEO if you don't know how reach out I'll help you uh, SEO is where it's at. Stop, stop wasting your money advertising on this system, trying to get leads. Like I've said it a hundred times before, nobody wants those strong 270 borrowers that uh, have no idea why you called them back or sent them a message back or anything like that. Nobody does. You don't want them. Your loan officers don't want them. Your realtors don't want them. Your insurance agents don't want them. Stop doing that. You've got to get your SEO game up. It's where it is at right now. Pay attention to it. Reach out. Go on any of the systems. Learn about SEO. Um, uh, we've got a lot of people that are doing the uh, Google Grant uh, system that I've been talking about. I'll probably put out another post about it here in another couple weeks or something like that uh, uh, to let people know about it. But th there are a tremendous amount of people uh, taking up on that and, and going to use that system. It's the one where it's a uh, uh, Google Grant SEO, $10,000 a month in grant uh, that you don't repay uh, for SEO for your business. So. 
pay attention to that one. That's, that's a big one. That's a huge one that's going on. But if there's anything that I can do to help you guys, uh, just reach out, whatever that may be. And I'd be more than happy to do it. Other thing, uh, I read a couple more articles this weekend about uh, the uh, ADA websites for real estate, for insurance, for financial planning. Make sure, make sure that your websites are up to date. Make sure that you have everything ADA compliant so you don't get nailed with something that's just not fair. Anyway, with that being said, I'm going to get out of here. Appreciate you guys. Have a good one.